I'm, my name's Katie Shepherd, and I'm the Disability Development Officer at Fulham Foundation. Matthew's done some work at college um, through a, like a shared community garden uh, where he's been doing some horticultural qualifications, learning about the basics of gardening, mowing lawns, uh, all those sort of skills that um, you, know, you would use in a garden or, or in a ground sort of environment. Um, he found that it was something he really loved um, and it's something that he could really excel at. Um, so we obviously got in touch through uh, DS WorkFit, so DS Down Syndrome Association, they have a WorkFit programme. Um, they came to us and said that they would help support us getting them into a traineeship type programme. Um, so at the moment it's a 12 week work placement um, with the aim that obviously at the end of it he can earn a job at the end of it. My name is Declan Robinson and I'm Head of Grounds at Fulham. It's an important sort of role that Matthew's um, partaking in and you know, like we're pleased to have him on board. We've sat down with his parents. We've we've had took part in training and stuff like that. So we've understood a bit about Down syndrome and how to work with that, and you know the characteristics of that. Stuart Mackley, assistant head of grounds at Fulham Football Club. So we did all sorts of little tasks like uh, cleaning out sprinklers, making sure everything's neat and tidy, being litter picking the site, we clearing leaves, just general tidiness jobs for the time being. Hoping to progress him onto more. Uh, skill, skill jobs. Tuesday, first day, I'll be here. The killer your tools up. I work the stew and dirt. I kid the, the pitch. We all feel he's part of the team already. You know, he has us laughing and joking. You know, it brings a new dynamic. Having someone like Matthew in the tea room, you know, he mixes it up a little bit. He's got a different attitude. He's very pleased to be with us which is, you know, it's satisfying for all of us. I think everyone in the sea room feels that as well. It's massive for them to feel uh, included, to, to feel like just like anyone else that's going out there and getting a job. You know, they've had to work hard, they've had to do the training, the same as any other person. Um, and to just feel that that is the norm, you know, and just to, to feel that when they come here, like he's come here and started work, nobody treats him any different than any other member of staff. You know, he's fully kitted out. He's exactly the same as any other member of staff and you know, he's here to do a job. Constantly making you laugh and smiling. When he comes into the office in the morning, he's uh, full of life. It's, it's brilliant, really fun. Every, every employer should be giving opportunities like this out. It's so rewarding for the staff and teaching him some valuable life skills as well. Confidence has grown massively since he's, all, like even just coming in and doing the interview, sitting in an interview situation and having that. Um, we've seen a difference at him at training. He's joining in more at training. He's, he's got that confidence. You can see that like this is this is where he feels at home. <laughs>